Disassociation, a fancy word, but it's a concept that should be understood if you expect to hit more powerful golf shots and better golf shots. That fancy word essentially means can you move one body part, or in this case, a body segment, independent of another. So if I'm giving a demonstration of disassociation, I would put a club across the top of my shoulders. I would then rotate into the backswing and I'd demonstrate an ability to move my pelvis, my belt buckle, without the tip of this grip moving forward at the same time. That's an essential skill, let's call it. That's an essential skill for you to be able to uh, learn. Otherwise, what you leave yourself susceptible to is you leave yourself susceptible to slices and weak, unpowerful golf shots, probably some compromised strikes as well. The first step towards developing disassociation, that disassociation I just described that should happen in transition, is an awareness of your hips moving without your ribcage moving. And so it really just involves you standing in golf posture, meaning enough hip hinge, enough knee flex, with your hands resting on top of the grip and then fairly easy is the observation I would make as to is the grip moving as I'm starting to rotate my pelvis backwards and forwards by some amount. Any amount is good, but the greater disassociation we can create, the greater separation from your lower to your upper, the more powerful a golf swing we can make. Now, the second step is once we've developed this awareness is using that awareness through the place that it needs to show up. So rather than just in front, we turn to the right or to the left if you're a left-handed player and we begin to do the exact same thing. Then we take golf swings where we pause at the top, kick a little bit of a hip rotation in, kick a little of hip rotation in, and then we use that on a golf ball. And sure enough, you're gonna to begin to feel that right in that transition, that movement from backswing or change of direction from backswing to forward swing, that belt buckle is gonna to start to lead more. It's gonna increase the speed the grip's moving and then subsequently the club head's moving and you're gonna to start to hit longer, more powerful shots. It's also gonna clean up any potential first slice that you might have. Give it a shot.